my bitches? Hi guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today I'll be reacting to Outer Banks Season 2, Episode 5. Oh my god, in the last episode, we were happy for a little bit, and then it just went crashing down once again. Because John B has now got arrested. He, he turned himself in because the cops, Sarah went to her dad to see if she could like convince him to choose between her and Rafe. And he's like, I can't choose. He ended up calling the cops. He The cops found them all. And John B decided to give himself up to save his friends. And and the, the cop was like beating him up and stuff. Oh my, oh, and Shoop knows it wasn't him because he knows the gun. That, he has Cameron's gun. I'm stressed. You know what? I don't want to talk about it. I want to speak about it. Um, <laughs> I'm just... I feel like every episode just gets more and more intense. And I'm just like, my, I can't do this. But I just can't stop watching because it it's so good. But I just want my kids to be safe. Protection squad, you know. But um, I'm not okay. So without further ado, let's just get right into episode five. Let's go. It's best to never say you've hit rock bottom. Oh, uh, but he's really just in... Okay. Okay. John Booker Rutledge, pursuant to the Carolina statute section I 14. I am scared. You are charged with murder. Maximum sentence would be the death penalty. Oh my god! The death penalty! He's six, he's 17, right? That's not allowed, right? Is he 17? 18. I don't know how old he is. But the, the death penalty, that can't be right. Dude, the way you're just, this really just we got real. We got real really quickly. What the? Are you kidding me? Death penalty? Yo, oh my god. I'm I'm going to literally not be okay. Oh, he's 17. Uh, he's 17. Uh, 17. Okay. Oh my god. Can you please shut up? Yes, same. You think this is some work because it was made to protect you and people like you. You'll have his day in court. That's exactly right. You should, because you're a murderer. Oh! I know you're upset. I understand. Nah, you know what? Kiara has. I would uh, look at this point. I would literally be going off at, at war too, because like, how do you, how do you stand there in your little rich ass suit and stuff? And you know, pretend everything's you know fine. Like, how do you? How do you? Like, how? Would, uh, the guilt would just. How would this? And Carol's like, how the how, how dare you? Like, I don't blame her, man. Oh, I've gone off too. Oh, he's got you fooled. He's got you all. No, I'm not just. Oh, same. Honestly, same. Show some respect. Okay. 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 Yeah, literally. I can't have a good night. You shouldn't have to go through this. Ah, y'all fucked. I'm done with this bitch. Sorry, I'm done. I can't. My brain. You just think it can't get any worse. And in the first two minutes, they put him as death penalty. He's 17. That can't be allowed. And our shoop's really pissing me off. Like, he's, only, he's literally pissing me off because he knows the truth. I know he knows. I know he knows. The poor kid. Are you serious? Easy is the only other person that knows Rafe was at home that day. Easy. I don't know what else to do. I got us into this mess. I'm gonna do my best to get us out. He's held captive by the enemy right now. Maybe even scheduled for execution. Oh, Are we just gonna sit here? I know. We have. Start by kidnapping Shu. Maybe. <laughs> it's not the worst idea, actually. Oh, it's not. No. That is actually <laughs> the worst idea I've ever heard. It's I know. Pretty bad. You know what? Please. I know it's bad, the tensions are high, I'm stressed, I'm like, look, I, I don't care what you have to do, just do it, but like, I don't want them to get in trouble even more, we can't kidnap Shoop, JJ, please, but like, honestly, at this point, it's all gonna shit, but, ugh, stay out of this, we're gonna do something about it, JJ, we're not storing a jail, it's not happening, make something happen, okay, but, I have to do it by myself, okay, yeah, but I'm scared though, because I know JJ, I'm stressed, you know, I don't know. Yes, for yeah, we should sure. be worried. Look, I'm gonna hit my parents, and I'm gonna see if I can get money for a lawyer. Because that tape number he has has exculpatory evidence that can exonerate John B. Yeah, Carla can help. I try. know. We'll talk about it later. Okay. That little jerk called you a murderer in front of the entire island. I know. But he is a murderer. Just gonna get worse. John B. and Sarah. Well, there has to be. Somebody that can help us, Ward. Think. Who? I'm dying. No. Oh, really? 
Patrick for half after. What the fuck, really? I knew that lady cop couldn't be trusted, but shouldn't she's like, I'm sorry you have to go through this, have a nice day, have a nice night. I knew she couldn't be trusted, shady ass. Really? Are you just gonna bribe every single cop in the in the in the island on Outer Banks, whatever? Really? Oh can't man. The way that They're really just gonna let an innocent guy go to prison or death penalty die because because Ward's paying them all off. I hate all of them. Just gotta show that he abandoned her. Like suicide. Yeah, I understand. What the fuck? Wait, to make it like look like John B abandoned Sarah so she'll go back to the family? They're gonna do something to John B make it look like suicide, he said. Okay, then. What the fuck? But this bastard kills us. No, he did it! Oh, sir. So he's gonna get the death penalty anyway, you know? What the fuck? They're really just. He's really gonna pay off this cop. This cop's doing it. She's like. I understand, like, understood, like, there's a guy, so they're gonna make it look like John B's gonna commit suicide or whatever, so then Sarah's gonna be like, oh, him, he abandoned me, so she'll go back to the family, because he's gonna die anyway, so it doesn't matter, are you fucked, really, bitch, you're really gonna do that, it better not work, it's not gonna work, I don't, I, I, it's not gonna work, something's gonna happen, but you they're, they're, oh my god, this is just disgusting, sick game, you know? Unfortunately, our relationship is collateral damage. Uh, I'm gonna collateral oh, your kid. <laughs> you know, it's just a truck. Just a truck. Do you recognize this? Yeah, does he know what that... Does he know? So, encouraging you should be the last thing I want to do right now. It looks like something my grandmother used to wear around her neck. Oh, hello? I remember seeing this when I was a little boy. Thank you. Okay, so the grandma had the key. Who knows where it is now? The mystery begins. Ooh, that's so interesting, though. Heard he's arrested for murder. Yeah, but he didn't. He didn't do it. Can, okay, yeah, I can promise. We, yeah. Somebody's framing him. Jambi's been arrested for murder. I mean, do you understand that? It's not all about you. Oh my god. Tread carefully. The one's on snap. You don't even trust me. Why should I trust you? All you do is lie to when me. When have I lied to you? Tiara. Oh Stop my it. god. Everything you're doing is for these boys. The no, the shit. The, uh, I, I, can't, I get where the mom's coming from a little bit. Like, I get it. But we, I told you, the mum doesn't know what we know as the audience. We don't, we know what they, what Kiara's gone through, and like she's always like, you know, doing everything for these boys. Like you know, they're bad news, blah 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 blah. You know, the pogue, you know, blah 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 blah. Like saying all this, but like, they are best friends. They're fam They found family. Let's be real. Her and the pogues, like they are. That's what you know. And she'll do anything for her friends as she should, and they will do the same for her too, one hundred percent. But the mum doesn't get that. And that's what it annoys me. Is like the mom. I'm like, hello, girl. Like, you did uh, really. Boy. You are so worried that I'm gonna sleep with a pogue like you did. Well, guess what? I already did. Oh, that was interesting. No, I'm a pogue, and I always will be. Yeah. This, this is, is why I hate coming back here. You wanna live like a pogue? Oh, she's gonna kick her out. Let me show you what that's like. Oh wow. Go live like a freaking pogue. Get your butt out of my house! That's horrible. What is the big deal about being a pogue? I don't under... Is it like, oh my god, this mom is doing my head in. Like, yeah, I get the worried parents part. I get that. Any parent would, would, would be worried. But the mom's not listening to her daughter. She's not listening. She's speaking at it, but she's not, she's not hearing what she has to say, Kiara. You know? She needs to trust Kiara. Like, and to throw her clothes like that, I'm sorry, that man. The mom's trash. I'm, so, I'm trying to, like, understand where she's coming from, but she's just getting uh, really annoying, you know? And the dad just sits there and does nothing. Like, really? Like, I could get, you know, get all these opportunities for your kid. Like, I get it. But these are her friends. These are her found family. Like, you can't ignore that. Like, it's important to her. Like, it doesn't matter if she's a pogue or not. You gotta, you gotta accept your daughter for who she is, you know? I don't know, man. What do I gotta do? Wow. 
So you can't. Oh my god. Yo can't. Do, listen, you can't do that. <laughs> the directors knew what they were doing in this scene. The directors knew what the fuck they were doing. They're not stupid. They know that the audience seems for JJ. They're not stupid. They know. <laughs> really? Oh my god. So you can't. They know what they're doing. I hate it. They know, they're not dumb. They're smart, man. Wait, is it? Um, don't like freedom very much now, do you, Cupcake? <laughs> my god, really? Jake, oh my god. Not worth it. <laughs> See you, Plum. That's nice to have. I hate him! I hate him! Why? Whoever directed this episode, you know what you're doing. You know what you're doing, and I appreciate that, you know? You know your target audience. I, I love that, you know? When they know their target audience, you know, it's good. Something in your mouth. Welcome to my humble abode. Yeah, when you said you had a new apartment, I had no idea. <laughs> That's so stupid, love. It's cozy. Operation Liberation, baby. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. What is that? Hear me out, though. Hear me out. Step one. Piss off the cops so badly they don't see what's coming. <laughs> you know what appendicitis is? Yeah. Remember eighth grade? Algebra final? Okay. <laughs> really? You're gonna like <laughs> this whole fucking plan? I love his enthusiasm. I love JJ's enthusiasm, you know? He's like really just trying to break John B out of prison. Like, go off. Like, look, you may as well because he's gonna fucking get attempted to die. He's gonna, someone's gonna come at him and try to kill him, you know? So, look, but the appendicitis is so really. <laughs> this is why I love JJ with my whole soul. Now will work. Take some of that and rub it into your face well, okay? You don't want that shit rubbing off when they check your vitals. It's when she takes her hand off that you let it rip, man. Scream like your life depends on it, like a lobster hitting the bottom. Okay. The the Let's board. go! Why not? <laughs> that seems like a solid plan to me, in my opinion. Then what? An EMT. You still just our first time back. So? You can do both. Get your economy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you're probably right, but you know what's even more dumb? You think you got any other way out of this? Time's up. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Trust me on this one. No, but like, if he... Okay, this plan is actually low key genius, I'm not gonna lie. Like, this could actually work up, because, you know, let's be real. But like, in doing this, and he actually escapes, let's just say, he's gonna look a lot worse because he's escaped custody. Which, because he's, he's going to make himself look even more guiltier. But at this point, if you don't get him out of there, that guy's going to try and kill him. So really, do we have a choice, you know? Like, this is a very stupid plan. Of course it is. It's a very stupid plan. But... Oh, that's his dad. Oh, shit. I see what you did there, Plum. How much are you split with you? <clears throat> You'll be back here one day. It's in the blood. That's rude! Slander my dirt no. Don't look at him. That's not gonna be him! That is not gonna be JJ, I'm telling you. I don't care what you will say. JJ was right, she's probably splitting with with sheep, let's be real. Like I'm not I'm not lying. But like She's like, it's gonna be you one day, it's in your blood. No, girl, what the hell? Just because his dad's in prison doesn't mean he's going to go there too, bitch. Look, he does do some very stupid decisions, let's be honest, you know. But he does it out of love for his friends, you know. I'll fight you, I don't care. JJ Protection Squad, where you at? You all know what this is, I told you. JJ Protection Squad, no harm comes to JJ, any of them, but especially JJ, you know. I don't want any of that slander against him. No JJ slander in my house. This is gonna have to go down. Yeah, exactly. You do know. It's better be okay. you, Rafe. So what I'm asking is, who would you pick? If it came down to it. <laughs> he did say Sarah was his favorite. So I told you I don't pick between my children and loving. I'm I'm here with you. I'm, I'm helping you. Dad, Dad, I, I saved your life. I just stop it. Okay, enough. No, 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 no. You just can't do 
it, can you? Oh my god! You can't do the hard thing. I can't do the hard thing. No, you can't try to have a real conversation. <laughs> oh my god! Okay. Did that so I see where he gets his psychopath tendencies from, let's be honest. The dad knows him and Rafe are much similar than they think, you know? And he doesn't want to admit that he's like his son. Because even Rose said he was like this since he was 10. Or like, there was something off about him. Like, she knew they had, there was like little, you know, hints or something that he might could be psycho, psychopathic, whatever. But like, the way that he's... Do, like, do I blame Rafe for like, having these psychopathic with his dad? Hello, like father, like son. Must run in the family. Except for Sarah, she's the only good one I told you. And maybe Wheezy. She's early yet. But like... He d oh my god. You fucked us! <laughs> All of us! Okay, same. Oh no, what's he gonna do? Oh, don't re What the fuck? Don't- Oh no, this is not gonna end well. Sarah, honey, no, no, Sarah, this is not, no, what's he gonna bloody do, and then, of course, Wheezy walks out, oh my god, we, we and he's gonna probably delete the message, I'm stressed, I'm stressed, Wheezy, why don't you have face ID on your phone so only you can see the message, why, oh, I'm not okay, um, that was the end of my pawn reaction. To check out my part two reaction to this episode, go click the link in the description box below. And I'll see you guys over there. Damn, the way that Rafe is just spiraling and spiraling. It's like everybody else is kind of getting character development, but he's de-escalating. Like, he's devolving before our very eyes. And it's really sad, really. But I don't have any sympathy for him. Like, I don't care. But, like, man... Weezy needs to get out of there as well. Rose needs to get out of there. I don't trust Rose, but she needs to leave. I don't know. She needs to expose them all. Anyways, guys, I'll see you guys uh, for part two. Click the link. I'll see you guys over there. Ciao for now. Bye, guys.